There we go, fish on. Big fish, dude. Big fish, dude. Big fish, dude. Freaking giant. <laughs> That's what we need. Short time. We got like 30 minutes left. Short time. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to another episode. Tonight is the best night of the week. It's Tourney Tuesday. It's grassroots tournament bass fishing. Tonight, B-Rock and myself are going head to head against a bunch of local hammers on a fairly tough fishery. Uh, this fishery has a bunch of dynamics to it. Uh, you can run way back, do a bunch of frogging. There's a bunch of deep structure out here, deep rock piles. There's nice weed lines, there's coontail, there's milfoil. I think for tonight, B-Rock and I are gonna try finesse fishing right out the gate. And if that doesn't go well, we can always switch it up. But uh, yeah, we're fired up. If you guys did not tune into last week, last week we actually took the W, so we started off the season very, very strong. But I'm super hyped because we got the freaking legend back in the boat. B Rock, what are you eating right now? Um, Italian sausage, egg, and cheese it burrito. Dinner of champions. Oh, it's so good. <laughs> so good. It's really what's gonna push us from like not doing good to doing really good that's what i'm saying it's a difference for sure so the history we have on this lake there's a ton of it we have been fishing this for 10 years fishing tournaments out here for 10 years um every year we kind of pick up something new pick up something a little different um conditions today it's 98 degrees freaking warm like a three mile an hour wind and uh it's hot it's yeah, super yeah. hot. We say it again. It is 98 degrees out. It was 99 in the truck, but it's it's legit. 98 degrees. Freaking 100 degrees out. It's so hot. It is not. But thankfully, we got this blackfish sun hoodie, and it's keeping us warm. The lucky overalls. Oh yeah, you gotta have these and uh, a little breakfast, lunch, dinner of champions, whatever you want to call it. So as far as our boat draw tonight, we're kind of in the middle of pack, so we're not gonna probably get our our first choice in spots, but we'll just kind of scrap around the rest of the night. And you guys know the deal. We need five largemouth bass, and we need them to weigh a lot more than everybody else's. So thank you so much for turning into Tourney Tuesday. We're going to lock in, we're going to hang out, and soon we're going to blast off to week two of Tournament Tuesday. Stick with me, stay tuned. You won't be pissed. All right, boys. It's blast off time. Time short time, but one, but two, but three, but four, but five. Go blast boat off. Six. Go boat seven. Six. Here we go. We're seven. Let's go. Very short run tonight. <laughs> We're just gonna start here and just kind of slowly make our way. We're just relaxing. We're relaxing, doing a little bit of fishing. I think I'm gonna start by throwing a little drop shot. B Rock is gonna start probably mixing things up. He's got some tricks up his sleeve. B Rock's always got tricks. All right, let's get it. There he is. Oh no, he spit it! He spit it! Frick! No! Yeah. White. No, dude. No. My drag wasn't my drag wasn't tight. It's tight. There he is again. Okay, back and got it. Throw back out. Throw back out. There's school though. Number one, baby. Number one on Brock Secret Hair Jake. There's one. Yeah. Take your time. Take your time. Here we go. Nice shot. We're not going to move. We're not going to move. <sighs> Things are happening fast. We're about. I was slowing that one down. Really? I slowed that one down. We're around. about five minutes into the derby. We got two fish in the boat, and Brock had a, another couple of them on. They're eating this. This is our secret little juice right here. This is a Ryan Pincala hand-tied hair jig. I hate showing you this on camera, I really do. But I'm gonna do it just because our boy, Ryan Pincala ties the sickest largemouth hair jigs in the world. And that's where we're catching them on tonight, so far. I don't know, we've only been fishing five minutes. Brock's on again. Right here, I'm right here, I'm right here. Nice job, nice job. Keep going, keep going, 
Keep going. Keep going. All right, guys, that's number three on the hair jig. I'm kind of just tickling the tops of the grass, killing it. There's another one. Again. This one feels big, dude. Right here. This one feels big. Right here. Right here. Take your time. Right here. Right here. Right here. Good. Good. Get up and in here. That's number four, guys. That's number four in five freaking minutes. Are you kidding me? They are just popping off as soon as they get in the net. This is kind of scary, but they are eating it. They are freaking eating it, dude. B-Rock is on fire. He's flaming. There's on again. Box on again. I'm right here. I'm right here. It's okay. It's okay. I'm gonna put this back here by you. Is that cool? Same deal on the freaking hair jig. That's, That's five, son. We got a limit. That's the fastest limit we've ever caught in Tourney Tuesday history. That's the fastest limit we've ever caught in a tournament ever. What time is it? It's 5.15. Holy shit. All right, guys, current time check. It is 6.24. Um, I'm just picking up the big camera right now because we're finally away from people. Things have calmed down a little bit. We're an hour and a half into the tournament and we have five in the well. But realistically, we had five in the well within the first 10, 15 minutes. And four of them came from B-Rock. B-Rock is still on fire. His shorts are just freaking burning. But um, yeah, I'm, whew, I'm blown away. I still got the jitters from Brock going on, 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 on. All of a sudden, I'm on. Live well is full. It, I don't know if we ran into a really hot school of fish. If the wind was blowing over that point, we were throwing the right bait at the right time and it just went down. <sighs> I don't know what you've totally seen so far. We've caught a couple small fish and pike after that, but um, I think we're just gonna kinda point hop. We're gonna throw some drop shot. We're gonna throw obviously that secret hair jig. And from there, we're just gonna kinda run and gun. We're just, we're head hunting right now. We're going for a giant, we're going for five pounder. We're an hour and a half into the derby. We have a lot of time. We're fishing relaxed, we're gonna settle in. I think I'm gonna put the big camera back here and B-Rock and I are just gonna give it our all. <sighs> There's, there's good competition out here and there's big fish, so we by no means have a good bag yet, but we've got a decent bag. So, let's get to it. There we go, good fish, good fish. Maybe not that great, hard to tell. Maybe better. Getting bigger? Yeah. Oh, it's a pike. Oh my God. Oh man. That got, that got the heart pumping a little bit. This is not a bad pike, ladies and gentlemen. I don't know how well you can see this. That's not a bad pike. See you later. Slime ball. Spot change. Spot change. All right, three or four spots and uh, we just have what we have when we started. So, spot change. Spot change. Spot number eight. Current time check is 724, we're still just hunting for a big one. Uh, our fish are doing good. We're chugging waters. Probably just gonna stick to the hair jig. Current time is eight o'clock, last hour, time to hydrate. <laughs> Let's go. Should have seen him in college.
Second call. Let's see what Damn. happens. All right, decent call. Um, not much bigger, but they're still eating that hair jig. I didn't think they would. The wind's kind of calmed down, but uh, they're still eating it. Let's get after it. 35, 40 minutes. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah, I did. There we go. Fish on. Big fish, dude. Big fish, dude. Big fish, dude. Freaking giant. Giant fish, dude. Giant, dude. Giant, dude. Get him. Get him. Give him in the boat. Nice. Boom, oh. baby. He's gone. He's gone, that cool. I'm just gonna throw him in. That's what we need. Fun. Short time, we got like 30 minutes left. Short time. Boom, baby. Boom. That's it. Current time check, 8.58. Time to weigh these fish in. I don't know how we'll fare. Maybe people smoked them. Maybe, I don't know. But uh, yeah, we'll take the boat off here, weigh him in, and then let you know how we did. Either way, we had an awesome night and kind of played around with a pattern. <laughs> yeah, we'll talk more later. It's, we had a great night. Did you have fun, mister? Yeah. B-Rock had fun. If you're not subscribed to him yet, you're just living under a rock. <laughs> Look who rolled into the weigh-in. Like the amazing friend so, he is. The question it's, is, do you deserve this or one of these? I guess we're gonna find out pretty soon. Yes, we'll wait. <laughs> it's good to see you, Hell of What's up, man? Thank you for coming. How, what are your predictions for this lake? Because you have a lot of history at this lake. Get uh, closer, get closer, get closer. I, I don't know. I saw somebody sneak one, like they weighed a fish and they ran a solo fish back. Oh. I talked to somebody else already said they, Ooh. one of these numbers. So I don't think it was easy. Hellabass called out last week. He said, Brock, tough act to follow. If you don't win this tournament, you're just letting down thousands of people. <laughs> we'll see what happens. Yeah, we'll see what happens. The day started off hot. The day ended hot. Big lulls in between. The star of the show tonight was definitely B-Rock. Talk to me about the beginning of the tournament. Probably the most fun you've ever had in the beginning of the tournament. Most hectic, too. Yeah, first cast, I hooked up and jumped off. Second cast, Hooked up again, that one came off right next to the boat, and third cast, I stuck one. And then we proceeded to catch, what, five, six more fish? Yeah. Just in 10 minutes. Yeah, we had a limit in like 15 minutes, it was crazy, and then it was horrible. We caught one or two here, a couple pike here, small. I mean, you guys saw the footage, it was it was not great through the middle of the day, then right in the evening, we came back there and just kind of repeated it, so. Made That's it where these suckers in. Fish. Good one Long, there. lean, post spawn. This was our smallest fish. Cookie cutter three pounders. Beautiful. Long lean. Another beautiful fish. That's a better fish. Starting to fatten up already. Ooh. Easy. Beautiful. A lot of life. And last but not least, a good healthy juice hog. Short, stout, fat. Boom. Very consistent bag. I think we've got around maybe 17 plus pounds. Right around there, yeah. Maybe 18. See how it goes. Oh, man. Yeah, okay, good. Oh, Jesus, guys. Long one. Thank you. Oh, come on now. 1918. Oh! The star of the show tonight. 100% for sure. His butt is still steaming. Dude's been on fire since 5 p.m. Well, uh, it all started yesterday. We came out here, fished around a little bit. I just had a hunch to throw a certain bait and you guys saw it all day long. The hair jig. The hair jig did it to him today. Hand tied by Ryan Pinkala. Yeah. We'll link sure. him down below. One of our good buddies. Amazing outdoorsman, amazing cook. 
Amazing everything. Continue. And we proceeded to smash. Smash, 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 smash. We smashed them. We smashed them really good. Yeah, we smashed them. We had an awesome night of fishing. Tell them what we weighed in. I think it was, what, 1918? 1910, something, somewhere around there. 19, just over 19. 1918, something like that. So just, yeah. Yeah, and second place had 16 something. But so. Back to back three pounds? Back to back wins by three pounds. We took home the freaking W tonight and some lunch money. Super pumped. Um, yeah, I can't give enough kudos to Brock. We literally had four fish in the boat in the first 10 minutes. So that just leads me to tell you subscribe to B Rock. He's the real freaking deal. And with the new electronics we have this year, Humber Electronics and the new boat, we're, we're, we're bringing it. We're bringing it. We're bringing like, it good. Like, it's no more games. Like, we're bringing it. Like, Brock and I are humble dudes, but like, we're having we're fun. Yeah. We're having fun. We're, we're here to smash bass now. I, I, any tournament we enter, I feel like we have an opportunity to put ourselves in front of the caliber of fish that's going to win the tournament. And um, yeah, back to back wins on Tourney Tuesday. I'm so freaking pumped. I don't know what else to say other than thank you, Hella Bass, for coming out. Good buddy Bill for coming out. They've been helping with the lighting all night. Good buddy Brock for freaking smoking them tonight. Good buddy Ryan for the freaking hair jig. And all of you, thank you so much. I guess there's nothing left to be said and stay tuned. And as always, let the adventure begin. See you. Move ahead. Oh my pretty babe. Something ain't right. Got to find a way to move ahead. Move ahead. Oh my pretty babe. I won't be around.